The probe scope is a totally self-contained USB oscilloscope. It's completely open source, with the hardware available under the CERN OHL and the software under various open source licenses. Imagine you cut the BNC jack off an oscilloscope probe and replaced it with a USB port. That's essentially what we've done with the probe scope. In terms of specs, we've built it to have similar capabilities to some of the popular entry-level oscilloscopes. The probe scope sports a sampling rate of 250 mega samples per second and an analog bandwidth of 60 MHz, with a maximum sampling depth of 16 million points. One of the probe scope's main features is its size. We're all familiar with traditional oscilloscopes like this one, which can take up a lot of space on your workbench, but our solution is barely bigger than the cable it lives on. One of the main focuses of our development for the final board was miniaturization. Our original set of development boards was over 18 square inches, but we got it down to just one-fifth of that size. As a result, the probe scope is one of the smallest high-performance oscilloscopes there is. For our final board, we took advantage of high-density interconnect techniques. To get the size down as far as possible, we created a six-layer board that uses a VN pad process. This allowed us to put all the control electronics right along the cable. Most entry-level oscilloscopes are over $100 per channel, but for the probe scope, we're targeting a price point of right around $100. And, while each probe scope is a single channel, our stacking mechanism allows you to have as many channels as you have USB ports. One channel isn't always enough, so we've designed the probe scope to be able to stack. By stacking multiple probe scope units, you can build an oscilloscope with as many channels as you need. If you head over to our project page on Hackaday.io, there's a whole wealth of information on the design decisions that went into it, where the project's at right now, and just everything else about it. So thank you for checking out the probe scope.